Today on Trash to Treasure Thursday, I thought I'd show you how to make this cute and inexpensive little plant pot out of something you normally would be throwing away. Join me and see how easy it is. Alright, so do you know what this is? How many guesses do I get? If you said the top to a toothpaste tube, you're right. This is a toothpaste cap. This one actually came off of um, some kind of hair care product. I don't remember what, but it was in a tube. I've got glue, bo glue tubes that have caps like this. Um, some toothpaste, it's harder and harder to find toothpaste with this kind of lid, but there's still a few. So we're going to do a trash to treasure this week that's really simple using these little tops. Now you can paint these by the way. I'm not going to paint them because I want to use them white. I think they'll look kind of cool where I'm going to put them. <coughs> but you can obviously paint them if you desire a different color. Just use something that's made for plastic. So I have some builders foam here and I'm really hoping that the lighting on the video is better than the lighting that I'm getting on my preview screen. So what we need to do is cut a piece of styrofoam, and I'm using, like I said, I'm using builder's foam. You could use any kind of foam that you've got, okay? Anything for this. We're going to smoosh it in there, kind of cut it off, Let's see if I can get it out of there so I put glue in. And we're going to put a little bit of glue in. The glue is probably not an absolute necessity because this will stay in pretty well. It's a pretty tight fit. There. And that's not right. I don't need a little bit bigger than that. I'm doing two of them together here. And I'm really hoping that the power doesn't go out. If this video goes kind of dark here all of a sudden, you'll know that my lights went out. Because it's really windy. I was just on the phone talking to my son, and we're debating whether our lights are going to stay on today. So far, so good. Okay, you don't even need to cut this off really neatly. You know, really, it doesn't have to fill really well. You can take more time with that if you want to. You can fill it up a little better. I'm going to shove in a few extra little pieces of foam. Now, you could use coffee grounds in here. I'm not going to today because I want this to be really quick and easy. But if you wanted to, you could cover the top in coffee grounds. I don't want to mess with that today. And this is, I'm just using, um, as you can see, I'm using a Q-tip, cotton swab. Uh, I don't have my, I'll get another cotton swab. I took my wet wipes out to the other room. I'm working on a, um, a huge project for my other blog. And um, half of my craft supplies are on the table you know, in my dining room. Okay, that's good enough. Now, this couldn't be simpler. We are going to take this is a plant, little one of these little 
silk plants is marked a dollar forty nine, and I know I got it for when they were closing them out for the season at one of the stores. Probably dry fabrics. Let's see if I can get this to cut off. These are not really good scissors. I'm cutting it with scissors because there's no wire up here. If there was wire up there, I would need to use wire cutters, but up in these parts, there's no wire. I need toothpick. Really should have planned, should have prepared better, but I've been really busy today. All right, and then we're just going to. Whoops. Let's see if I can juggle the toothpick. Make a hole. Put a little glue. I like to put a little glue there, and then I'll dip the stem into more glue. Let's put the bigger one in this one. And there, we've got a little plant in a pot. And yeah, it would probably be better to actually let this dry, but. You can let the paint dry if you want to. I'm not going to today because, you know, this is trash to treasure. It's supposed to be quick and easy, and there's nothing quicker and easier than that. So, there we go. Let's see if I can get a little closer. Whoops, wrong way. I always go wrong way first. There you go. There will be some, there you go. There will be some pictures. I'm sure you. there will be a picture on the blog post. Um, but there you go. A plant pot out of a the cap off of a tube. Remember to look at all different kinds of tubes. You'll find caps in different colors, different sizes, and they're really fun to make little pots out of and other things. I'm sure I'll do other things out of them in the future. So if you enjoyed this Trash to Treasure project, be sure and come back next time and see what we do. Um, and be sure and check out the blog post and find us on Facebook. I'll talk to you later. Bye.